Tuesday? What's Keep today, Liz? Cruise day! <laughs> we went straight from Tuesday to cruise day! Woohoo! We're on vacation! There she is, the Scarlet Lady! Oh, it looks like somebody's out on the running deck. What's up there, Scarlet Lady? In our last video, we took you on a tour of the brand new Terminal V. We made it! We made it! Officially we're here! <laughs> we are officially on board! <laughs> here we go, we're approaching our room. Today we are staying. Oh, hi there, Sarah. Oh, check it out. The thing opened as we came in. Did you see that? On Virgin Voyages, balcony rooms are known as sea terraces. Your sea beds can be converted into a couch by day and back to a bed at night. Almost all sea terraces come with their own hammock. The bathroom is compact, but the shower offers both a rain shower head and a handheld shower head. There's an iPad that controls everything, from the TV to the curtains and even mood lighting. What I really wanted to show you right now is we got these nice hooks. Good tip we have heard. Get some nice uh, magnetic hooks. Got our masks, hat, sunglasses right on the way out for each of us. So we got some stuff ready to go in case we forget. After watching the safety video, we headed to our muster station to check in. After a very brief demonstration on how to wear life vests, we set out to explore the ship. We made our way upstairs to aft 16 because the first thing we wanted to do was check out the net. How you doing out there? Doing okay now that I'm over the, the other level. A little further, there's a bigger drop. Yeah. No, it's strong, but this freaks me out. It does look cool with the weight right there. Also on deck 16, you'll find an assortment of different exercise equipment and devices. Once you pass through the fitness obstacle course, there is a plethora of unique and fun and inviting seating. As you head up to deck 17, you'll find the runway, which is the jogging track, along with the perch, which is the outdoor yoga studio and lounge area.
Let's have some nice shade up here. Got a nice big bed, lounge area. Other side over here, plenty of seating for at least like four or five people. Oh, got a nice little third bridge in there too. Check that out. Moving down to deck 15, you'll find the Aquatic Club, which has a weeding pool for socializing and a small plunge pool. There are several jacuzzis in the well-being pool area. One of our favorite areas to spend time was the dock. Located aft deck 6, it's the perfect location to gaze off into the distance and watch the wake. There are so many Instagrammable places on board the Scarlet Lady. These are just a few of the fun poses we did while on board. There is no shortage of things to do on board the Scarlet Lady. You can spend your sailor loot in shops or test the fates in the casino. Channel your inner musician at the Groupie, a private karaoke room, or by putting the needle on the record in the record shop. What we really liked about this cruise is that you are guaranteed to find something you enjoy regardless of your age or fitness level. To quote their website, sweat, relax, or just be still. Virgin Voyages offers wellness activities from organized fitness classes to state-of-the-art equipment. It's up to you how much exercise, or how little, you want to do on your cruise. We signed up for the 80s VHS workout, shake weights included. next week as we show you the food and entertainment on Scarlet Lady. Thank you for joining yet another Stellbot adventure. We hope you enjoyed coming along with us today on the Scarlet Lady. Virgin Voyages! So if you enjoyed today's video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel if you've not already. Leave a comment below letting us know what you thought about today's video. And what you think about cruising in general and Virgin in particular. So come along with us next time and we'll see you on, on the, the next, next adventure. adventure.